my friends. Hello and welcome. Mmm. That's some goodness right there. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh, let me get comfy here. All right. Gonna sit back and enjoy for like the next 20 to 30 minutes, depending on how fast I can go through this stack. As you all know, this is now number 17 of my entire movie collection. And yes, it's Monday. Monday, Monday, Monday. And I'm ready to rock. I'm ready to roll. I'm ready to review. Well, I'm not going to review. But I am ready to show you the next stack of 50. Uh, we are at, um, it looks like, 800 to a 50. 800 to 850. That's where we're at. We're busting it out. So let's just get on with it. Um, oh, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I do not do these videos every single day, only on Mondays uh, for now. We'll see if it changes or if I have to do add more. Or, uh, I don't know, but I got to get through my titles in order to get through my titles. We got to do this. So, all right, let's get in to what we got. The first one so far for this video is Will Smith. Hitch kind of washed out a little bit uh, it's because it's a white background but we got hitched or hitch hitch not hitched hitch with will smith awesome you guys um this is a really great movie it's kind of you got the will smith character and he uh he's kind of like waking up to the reality of well not being such a jerk <laughs> um it's kind of cool all right what do we got left oh and i've not seen this the Snow of Kilimanjaro. I have not seen this one. There's a lot here I haven't seen. I'm discovering these at the same time you are, I promise. I, I am, I am. Um, Stuck Between Stations. I have not seen this before. Um, let's see. Zoe Lester Jones. Michael Impel Impelli. Impelli. I guess that's how you say it. This is a very interesting looking... Uh, Rated R, 2012, 84 minutes. Hmm. Don't know much about it. It looks like a drama, possibly. So, on to the next. Ooh, ooh, I know this one. You got some LL. No, it's not. It's not LL. It's John Travolta. Gosh, I'm horrible. John Travolta in Be Cool. These white cases, yeah, they just... It doesn't matter what I do with the lighting uh, here. The, the cases just don't seem to, the white ones, the white cases just don't seem to like want to show their true colors. <laughs> um, oh, this is different. I've never seen this before. It's got a uh, sticker on it. Gross. Uh, we got some sight. He's not just seeing things. Uh, horror flick I have not seen. There's a lot of movies I haven't seen. A lot, a lot. Went through this uh, buying phase for a long time. See, see, the thing is, the reason I don't watch a lot of my stuff or haven't watched a lot of my stuff is because I'm a numbers game. <laughs> I have a lot of different friends with a lot of different points of view and things they want to watch. And when they come over, I want them to be able to find something that interests everybody. So it doesn't matter who you are, you'll find some. I guarantee you'll find something on my shelves that you like. And... If I watch a movie and I really don't like it, it's gone. It is. Uh, ooh, The History of Boys. Okay. That is, looks like a British film there. Very interesting. History of Boys. All right. Keep going here. The Last of the Random Ra Pride. The Last of Random Pride. Interesting. No idea. Looks like a Western. Uh, can I tell who's in it? Let's see. Oh, a lot of Spanish. Is this one of those? You know what? I bet this is. I bet this is a spaghetti Western. This looks like it might be a spaghetti Western. Chris Christopherson is in it, though. Maybe it's a spaghetti Western. I'm not sure. Oh, by the way, I just discovered... I just discovered what spaghetti Westerns are. I'm not a Western guy. I don't watch a whole lot of Western movies. But a spaghetti western, from what I've found out, is a western that was filmed like in Italy, I think. Yeah, that's cool. Hey, I'm down. Um, ooh, Q, S um, suspect zero. Uh, took me a minute. Sorry about that. 
Q. Give me a minute. I'm back. Okay. All quiet on the Western Front. Looks like it is like a Vietnam, not Vietnam, a World War II movie. Looks like a World War II movie. It is a World War II movie. Interesting. Uh, Richard Thomas is in this. That is cool. It was uh, once owned by the library. Uh, the Midnight Horror Collection Volume 2. I hope I own Volume 1. And in this collection, we will find Haunted From Within, Doll Graveyard, Watch Me, The Fear Changer, Evil Bong 2, King Bong. That's weird because the other first one's not in here. Uh, dum, 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 what? Demonic Toy, uh, Demonic, okay. Demonic Toys 2, Zombie Dearest, and Deadfall Trail. Well, I, I own Evil Bong 2 in its own case. So I ain't too butthurt about it, but that's kind of a cool pack. Uh, eight movies and <laughs> eight movies on two different discs. I'm sure the film quality of these are gonna be amazing. They're like total HD. <laughs> Uh, two movies on one DVD. Are you serious? What is with people doing this? Uh, the Ruthless Four and Border Shootout. So, again, westerns it looks like. I don't know anything about them here. Glenn Ford. Hmm. All right. Ah, we got some Grace. Mmm, great. Great movie. Uh, if you didn't hear that sarcasm, <clears throat> don't judge me. Oh, yes, Mr. Smith again in iRobot. This movie will freak the average person out. Yeah. Good movie, though. Great movie. I should review that soon. Let's see. Uh, hide and Seek. Ooh, you can kind of... Ooh, it's got glare and shine and hmm. hide and seek with Robert De Niro. That's a very shiny case. Uh, Surf Ninja. Woo Who's in that? Is that Rob Schneider? It is Rob Schneider. Ha ha. And Leslie Nelson. Okay, that that might be that might be a nice funny movie. What is this from the eighties? Nineties. What is this? Ninety two. 92 rock on this is interesting how come i didn't hmm, i don't know i i i i i, I just I, I don't know uh runaway jury this movie was decent um yeah uh you got uh cusack in it uh hackman in it hoffman in it and was was Sezi, whatever her name is cool and, ooh, The Cookout. This was a good one. I believe I reviewed this just recently, The Cookout. Uh, this movie was actually pretty decent and kind of funny. Ooh, Cooper Mountain with some Jim Carrey. Not his best. That's so sad. But it's Jim Carrey. And it's got some Jim Carrey stupidity in it, so it's not the worst film ever. But, um, yeah. What do we got? Oh, hello. That's different. We got an American carpool. Interesting. Hmm. Looks like a comedy where they're making fun of movies again. Hmm. Oh, an American Carol. Excuse me, not carpool. American Carol. Uh, yeah. It's kind of ridiculous looking. Might be kind of fun. They're making fun of... Is that Michael Moore? Yeah, they're making fun of Michael Moore. <laughs> Might be a good movie then. <laughs> uh, 
I'm not taking sides. <laughs> Don't judge me. Just because I'm, you know, beautiful. Mmm. Uh, we got the hoaxed with Richard Gear. Mr. Richard Gear. We got Dana Carvey in The Master of Disguise. I do remember watching this. It was actually a really funny movie. Um, it it was stupid. It was it was stupid. Let's be honest, but it was funny. So, and of course, Dana is Dana is Dana. You, it, there's no getting around it. Uh, yeah, I don't remember watching this, and I think I probably should watch it again. Breakfast on Pluto. This is should be on my to do list. Uh, this. I want to say I, I've, I've owned this for a while, a couple, well, probably about three or four years, but um, never seen it. it. It looks interesting. All right, what do we got? Ah, Biker Boys. Biker Boys is a classic sort of 90s kind of movie. Um, yeah, it, it's, it's, it's all right. A lot of, uh, it, it reminds me a lot of... Um, Fast and the Furious and, and that kind of thing. So, pretty good movie. Ew, we got a Blu-ray. You know what that means. And there's early on Blu-ray. It's fairly new. Uh, we got uh, James Mc, McVeigh in Split. Split? Was he split from reality? No. All right. Whoop, whoop. On to the next stack. We're moving right along. Getting this done. We got a guy thing. A guy thing. Who's this? Liana Julia Stiles, Jason Lee, and Selma Blair. A guy thing. Hmm. Interesting. I bet this is funny. Especially um, with uh, Miss Stiles. I bet this is funny. Let's see. Endless love. Ooh. Endless love. Ooh. No idea. Looks like a chick flick. Not my thing. Um, oh, and by the way, yes, uh, the wife is taking a break, uh, but she will be back. She'll be back. It's it's just things are happening right now, and she'll be back. Uh, trapped in Paradise. Another Dana, right? Isn't it Dana? Yeah, another Dana Carvey. Trapped in Paradise. Who else is in here with him? Uh, John Lovitz and Nicolas Cage, Trapped in Paradise. Yeah. Oh, got some Madeline. See? I got stuff for everybody, including the little kiddos. Uh, this is two stories. Uh, Madeline and the Dog Show and Madeline's Rescue. And if all you don't know, Madeline was a TV show. And, uh, yeah, for kids. So... First time, first time on DVD, it says. It's probably the last time it was on DVD. Ah, <laughs> uh, The Cat in the Hat with some Michael Myers. Yes. Michael Myers. What a, you know. It's an age not to pick that name. Hmm, Michael Myers. Why does it, it, it reminds me of somebody that, Likes to kill. I can't remember who. Um, oh, the glass house. Yeah, that's a good one. Um, this was actually one of my first, not my first, but one of my first uh, dark, scary thriller movie thing. The glass house. Don't throw stones if you live in a glass house. I might go. Ksh! And then you're like, oh darn, the wall's gone. Hmm. Let's see. Georgia rule. We got some Jane Fonda, Lindsay Lohan, and Felicity Hoffman. Ooh, Georgia Rule. Okay. We got Little Black Book. Man, she, look, oh God, she's so gorgeous. Um, let's see, Brittany Murphy, Holly Hunter, and Ron Livingston. And Kathy Bates. I love Kathy Bates. Um, is that Brittany Murphy? If that if that's Brittany Murphy on the cover there, will you let me know? She is. Ooh. 
<clears throat> pretty. Okay. <clears throat> I can say she's pretty. Nice. Uh, oh, go fish. Got nothing for you. Go fish. Go fish. Um, I don't remember this one. I want to say, just by looking at the cover here, it looks like an independent. I think it's an independent film. 1994, hour and a half long, and in black and white, which means uh, it is probably artistic in nature. Ah, Fired Up. Okay, this looks like a teenage comedy full of sex jokes. That's what it looks like to me. Full of sex jokes. Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen. Actually a pretty pretty good movie. Um, my son really likes his Transformers. Really big fan. I got a four movie pack here for you. And in this movie pack we have The Freshman, uh, Wally Moses, uh, Vince Versa, and The Fine Mess. It's a classic, by the way. The Fine Mess. So, good. for decent movies, um, I've seen two of them. So, there you go. And guess. Don, guess, which, guess which two. Guess. guess. Um, Hostel and Hostel Part 2. I used to own both the Hostels on VHS. And I found that and I was like, grabbing it. No, not VHS. DVD. I think I had them on DVD. And, um, yeah. Hey, if I can multiply. And what is cool. Oh, darn. It's not. Never mind. It's not cool. It's only one disc. I shouldn't have gotten rid of it. Oh, well. Let's move on. It's hostile. Oh, yes. Um, this one. Mickey Rorick. Domino. Domino. Good film. Um, if you like dark suspense, uh, manly movies, it's definitely one to, to check out. Um, it's it's pretty good. Pretty good. All right, what do we got here? Ooh, Death Race Unrated and Death Race Two. And I'm guessing it's like a Fast and the Furious, but I'm not a thousand percent sure. Uh, includes two versions, rated and unrated, for both movies. That's kind of cool. Wow, it's got like a Mad Maxi kind of thing going on. And, all right, these need to be reviewed, so I'm going to set them over there. I like action. All right, we got Robots. This was actually a cute movie for kids. Um, it is about a family and this young boy. Uh, they're all robots, and this young boy is coming of age and becoming a man, and he has to switch out his parts for more, bigger, manlier parts and all that kind of stuff. And it's just there's a lot of um, there's a lot of adult humor in this, but it's sly enough that I don't think the kids necessarily pick it up on it. It's really good. Um, Amanda Bynes, Drew Carey, Robin Williams, definitely. Uh, definitely a watch if you haven't seen Robots. It is, it's a cute movie. Ah, Shrek the Halls. And I like Shrek, but this was a good movie, but not, not my, not my favorite. I actually like Shrek 2 the best. True fact. Oh, and <laughs> this one I don't like, <laughs> part two, I like part one. We got Happy Feet. I prefer Happy Feet 1, the original, but Happy Feet 2. And, oh my gosh. <sighs> Deadpool. Deadpool. That's not right. Whatever. <sighs> Green Lantern. Deadpool. <sighs> Green Lantern. <laughs> Who do you like better? Green Lantern or Deadpool? The wife wants Deadpool. She thinks Deadpool is way cooler. Um, I know I'm voting for her. She technically already voted if you saw her match. Oh yeah, we're not doing that this 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 
yeah, wow, that is so weird. This has been a weird month, you guys. Um, the wife is the wife is doing okay. She's fine, just a little on a hiatus at the moment. She'll be back, like I said. Uh, M I two, Mini Black. I love all these. All the Mini Black movies are amazing. It's funny how I own this one on on uh, VHS and the original Men in Black. Oh, I see it right there on. Or, I'm tired. I own this on DVD and the original one on VHS. Um, that, that my brain. I must be exhausted. Oh, and Dragon Two. So this movie was decent. Um, DreamWorks did this. I wouldn't say it was anywhere near my favorite. I kind of liked Aragon. Uh, when you talk about dragons, I thought Aragon was a little bit better. This is, a, of course, a cartoon. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, Dragon 2. And that wraps up this episode. So, if you're brand new to my channel, um, definitely hit the subscribe button, ring the bell. Leave a comment down below. Have you seen any of these? Do you know something I don't know? Uh, any conversation you want to have, let's do it. Let's have that conversation. And, hey, you know, let's try something new. If you like this, share me out on social media uh, and see if we can get my numbers to move again. <laughs> all right, you guys. I will see you all real soon. So until then, bye for now. Bye. Toodles.